Rewind plays the Lords. He plays uh, Roy and Krom. Mostly Roy, though. He also has a little mag, too, for memes. And don't forget, they fixed Roy's up beat, so this is going to be no Sorry. Um. Alright, okay. Alright, so Roy and Three, Yoshi, what do you think two, about this one? one I'm just thinking Roy's going to win this. I, I think I think Roy kind of takes this away from Yoshi, not super hard. It's more about like the fact that both of these characters have very good mobility. It's just a matter of Yoshi not really enjoying this much that much. But uh, you know, Yoshi does have that neutral B, or he also has the neutral air as well. Neutral air is going to be such a huge factor in just breaking these combos that Roy's got going here. Definitely. Nice. The cat, you know, it's a rough. Oh, good forward tilt, just taking him out. Uh, the Yoshi special. Okay, now, if you played Yoshi, you have killed yourself by using side B more than once at least. I haven't. <laughs> do you play Yoshi? Yeah, I do. Oh, oh okay. Oh, okay, Mr. Genius. I mean, I always, I, I still kill myself on the rare cases that I play Yoshi. Just gotta be confident with your side B, yeah? Yeah, you do. Uh, AKA not do it on fade. Pretty much. Pretty much. Nice back air. And back air got really buffed this time around. It's a really strong move. Oh, these collisions. <laughs> Whoa! Okay. Oh, yeah. He's got to be careful at the edge here. I'm definitely feeling the Roy this matchup, you know? Yeah, I am as well. Like, it looks like... Like I said, it seems like Yoshi has just always had a problem with disjoints, but the fact that Roy has to get a lot closer than other sorties to get maximum damage, uh, it says a lot, but Roy does get some nice stuff off of uh, Sour Spots. Uh, he's able to get, uh, I believe, like Sour Spot Air into certain things. He's also be able to rack up damage fairly fast. We shouldn't really struggle too much. Yeah, and Roy doesn't have the best landing options in the world, so like when it comes to Yoshi's up air, that's gonna be a problem for Roy. Oh, almost breaking the shield. Nice, poking with the back air. <gasps> I thought he was gonna poke with the down smash, he didn't get it. Nice, okay, he finally got the down smash. Alright, now Rewind's not really too far behind, though. All he really needs to do is get like one good read, set him off stage. But that's the thing, uh, Yoshi has a really decent disadvantage state. Like, it's like, if you're in disadvantage, you have the super armor jump, and you do jump pretty high, and he has great aerial mobility. It's probably, I think it is the best aerial mobility in the game. Um, which is, uh, something that's been that way since Smash 4, as far as I know. Ooh, nice. And don't forget, he can also, like, you know, when he's shooting, he can just quickly Nair and get, like, a free hit off him. Yeah? yeah, yeah, Nair's great. Back up damage off of it. Yeah, Nair's so good. Oh, there's that there. <laughs> there go. Yeah. Oh boy, okay. For me, I thought uh, Yoshi was gonna do an up smash there. Yeah. He would have died. I was expecting a dash attack. <laughs> okay, there's that sour spot we were talking about. But honestly, damage is damage, but right now we don't need damage. We need to take that guy out. There's that there taking that one out. Oh, and Yoshi's just going right back in there with the back air. Yeah, you really have to respect Yoshi's out of field options. Alright. Going around the neutral. Okay, taking him off stage. Man, look at all that damage that he got. Off of that one. Right. Off of that one dancing blade. That's why, you know, I just, I feel like Roy's got it, you know? Just takes a bit. And he's kind of starting to read Yoshi and what he's doing. And I feel like as soon as he starts understanding this matchup, he's just going to get it, yeah? Yeah, he does run faster than Yoshi. Ooh, okay, this is getting close. No, that's not the, that's not the call. Oh, that uh, not quite. There we oh. go, yeah. The Sour Spot did it. Sour Spot and Rage, hey. Can we take those? It's not an option. Failure is not an option.
Now there is something to be said about uh command grab potential. Like that is that is a really big thing. Because like you know, can just kind of condition you to heal uh, more often than not. Oh, uh, with A, uh, he has the you know the ability to be able to run in and pressure you. So when you start shielding, you're probably going to catch more than a few human bees. Human bees can land. In they can turn into anything you want. You take like half damage in an egg, but you can just dare him and do all types of damage stuff. Get him. These dancing blades are just beautiful. Yeah, they really are. They're racking up damage. And just, I feel like he's just gonna end this. Like, the, the fact that you're able to mix up the, the timing and delay your dancing blade, and then you can even change like what you're gonna do with the dancing blade, it, it's a really, really nice bit of cool. And some of really good with Thank right. God he got that tech. Yeah, he got that back here and took him out. Alright, oh, he cut the speed spot on that. That was really good place. Alright. Yeah, and Rewind does like to go for those up uh, so often. It, it's not a bad call. Right? Well, now the up is definitely better. They fixed the uh, multi hit on it. So oh, it's definitely yeah. going to score him a few kills. Yeah, for those of you who don't know, we're playing over the patch. Every, every single system is patched up. Oh, that was a I don't think Yoshi had any changes in this patch. Uh, you know, I don't know if we did or not. I, I will withhold, but I don't. I don't think I saw anything for Yoshi either. Okay. All right, Chilo uh, had to rewind at the edge there, but you know what? He still has a pretty good neutral going on right now. Oh, this is not up there. Chilo just kind of pushing him back. Oh, he's been trying to get that oh, seal no. break. He's been trying to get that seal break forever, and he finally got it. Alright, but uh, I mean, all you really have to do is just play patient and just kind of wait for what you're trying to do here. Oh, it feels like this game we want to punch. Yeah, basically. I mean, you definitely have uh, more of a window to do so with that down smash. You know, that down smash is actually working out pretty well uh, because Roy's recovery is successful. So he has pretty good area ability. There we go. Oh my god, that's just kill. I don't know. Nair, uh, Nair, Nair can really just start you on a trade of death or destruction. For both of these characters. Oh, oh, yeah. oh yeah, that is the uh, unstoppable angle. There's not much you can do. Yoshi yeah, I, I do think out of all the sword characters, I think uh, Roy... He still has the advantages of being a sword character, but it's more the fact that he has to get in a lot closer to Yoshi, which means he's he has to work harder. He has to, he has to work a little harder just in terms of uh, just getting in, just extending his range. However, if you're really, really confident in your sour spot combos and you, and you can make those tick confirms, because oh, he swapped. Yeah, Crumb is probably Three, a better thing. Yeah. Two, probably a better one, thing. Crumb's have been go. about the same. Because it's just like, if I'm going to get down smashed, then I'm get, probably going to die anyway. You know, so I, I could see why it's probably a good thing here. Racking up the damage already. Yeah. Ooh, he's trying to land the, the up air there. Oh, nice. Yeah, Reset was trying to go for the cross up there. I see Yoshi being really hesitant this time around. Well, I think he has a lot more uh, space that he has to respect. I mean, I, I can't speak for how much weight. Uh, I can't speak for how much bigger uh, Trump's sword is than Roy's. I don't really know what the but the sweet spot is uh, that It's Roy's. very slight. Yeah. 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 Well, the grab, that was a good grab. Yeah, paying attention to uh, how he's in the uh, defensive options. Yeah, Reset's probably going to be looking for those air dodges more often than not. It's, and that's the thing, like I said about uh, Yoshi's disadvantage stage, that it's good because you're able to get out of things with that double jump, but you're going to be in the air for a lot longer than you probably would like to be. Yes, Krom, all the opportunities to just sort of plan out what he's going to do to you. Uh, yeah. There we have the air dodge. Yeah. Yoshi getting a directional air dodge and is up to getting uh, more of a piece of vertical height. It's really nice. It's like he has a true recovery. Oh, that was good of me. He didn't get uh, much off of it. It's like a fan of the almost. Yeah, that was weird. He scared him. Alright. Okay. The Nair's coming in. Grab there. 
there. Man, that down smash is really good. Yeah, and I think Rewind's starting to get used to that, uh, that down B, though. He got hit by it last time, but uh, it is a tactic that's been new, showing his colors. Okay, gotta beat the game here. And that air Get up the B, uh... That is not over yet. Yoshi's pretty heavy. Yoshi's pretty heavy. But that landing. There you go. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I got the fist bump. Yeah, I mean, like. All you really had to do was sort of grab the ledge there, but he was probably afraid of getting nared or edge guarded. So I, I could see why he was trying to land, but he, he just landed right in front of Krom. You never want to roll into Krom, and you never want to just, like, land in front of Krom. I think uh, that goes for a lot of sword characters as well. You never really want to roll into it. Never roll into them. Ever. I, I think you just don't want to 